Good morning, my cuddle bugs. It's me, Anna Marie, and I'm just sitting here at my island using my new tripod with my <clears throat> uh, iPhone 12. Colton and I both have a slight cough. Um, we were around family for the first time uh, this year, and uh, we might have developed a little bit of a cough, so we're monitoring it. It is January 2nd, yeah, 2021, and... I figured I'd give like a little update. I did just get out of the shower. You're not eating my toast. <laughs> <laughs> I did just get out of the shower, so my face is always super red, but I did put some like clarifying um, ointment on because my new, well, it's not new. I've been taking it for like six or eight months. Um, my new like uh, depression anxiety medicine, <coughs> excuse me, makes me break out and you can see that in my chest. So don't, don't judge. <laughs> but I figured I'd get on. Say hi, everybody. Colton is doing some Legos today. Yeah, right behind me. Yeah, right. Well, on the floor. Go do them. No. Just go do them. Okay. And while I'm on here, I, I figured I'd just eat my breakfast with you guys. Colton did eat already. Um, but I have some avocado toast um, with a lot of the freaking... Um, everything but the bag of seasonings uh, because I accidentally dumped from the wrong side. So I had to like dust that off, but it's one piece of uh, uh, whole grain multi-seed toast because my keto toast from Costco actually molded. Um, it's like it got wet or something, I don't know. Um, but I'm using this today and a half of avocado and garlic salt and then that seasoning. And then since I've been coughing, I do have, and my nails are horrible, I know. I have an emergency here. Your nails are great. Oh, thank you, baby. So the emergency immune, because I'm <coughs> trying to get rid of this cough, but um, I don't know. I've had two COVID tests this year. They were both negative, and I, both times I had a very slight little cough like this, and so did Colton. So if it continues or it gets worse, I will go in for another COVID test. We have free testing sites here. If it doesn't, I'm just going to deal with it. So let's get this toast. Mm. I don't want to get the COVID test. I know. It hurts. Well, it, well he, it stings to me, but it tickles to him. Yeah. It tickles to me because it's like, like the little white thing. Yeah. And it tickles. That's so I haven't it. talked to you guys in a while. Like, just sit down and talk. I haven't ranted. I haven't done nothing. You know why? It's because I've been so stressed out. <laughs> Literally so stressed out. And it's just like Colton James. That's one reason. So Colton has been virtual schooling most of 2020. Um, he did end up going back to school three hours, four days a week around um, mid-September or something. But anyways, there's still a lot of virtual schoolwork we have to do together. So on top of working 40 to 50 hours a week, I'm also doing homework with him. And during all my conferences, you know, Colton does his Hulk smashing and his Legos and <clears throat> everything silly because that's my silly little guy. Um, and those things can be a little stressful. Yeah, it could be a little stressful for my mommy, but not really me because I had to see the like, like, That's right. They get, make you really smart. And actually, over the Christmas holiday, I counted. Colton got about 8,000 Legos. So, <laughs> if my feet aren't already messed up, they're yeah. going to be now. Yeah. <laughs> That's all my floor looks like there, baby. Yeah. And that tent there, Santa brought Colton. And that was weird. It, like, took a screenshot of me. Oh, did I do something? <laughs> um... Santa brought that little tent and we made that into like a iPad corner slash reading little tent. And he did sleep there their New Year's Eve too. Yeah, so he was so confused when I woke up. <laughs> he was, he was. I slept so confused that I didn't even know my name. Oh my gosh. So Yeah. I'm chewing, I don't want to be rude. <laughs> That's right. Or in the middle. We always happy, right? Yeah. 
Yep, but sometimes I make you eat different things. Oh, it's okay. Um, so, what was I saying? <coughs> oh, what else has happened to me in 2020? Let's see, I moved. You guys know that. I haven't even done like a proper tour. You guys are sitting at my island. There's my living room. There's the hamsters. There's Colton. I'm sitting at the island, which is kind of a mess right now. Um, I'm still cleaning up from the holidays. Um, I've been doing it slowly because I did have that last week of the year off. But uh, yeah. Um, so yeah, cleaning, deep cleaning. Um, I did, let's see. I've been working a lot. I think this year I've trained at work four interns, five interns, um, and then I have trained a couple continuing workers. Over the vacation of my, my holiday vacation, I did help uh, start a new intern as well. So I'm always working whether I'm actually online or just working from my phone. It seems like it's endless, but I also love my job and I love helping um, our new hires. So <coughs> that's just something I volunteer to get into, right? Yeah. And it's really fun to do, too. That's right. Let's see. My life has been very uneventful, I would say, this 2020, because Colton and I couldn't really do anything. Everything was shut down because of what? Coronavirus. That's right. We couldn't. We did the splash pad a couple times when there wasn't a lot of people there, and we did do the beach a couple times, but um, other than that, you had to, like, you have to, like, first of all, pay to go to the beach, Second of all, they like counted how many people and you could only be there an hour and it just wasn't fun for us. Um, and we couldn't do much of anything else because all like the indoor or other outdoor activities were closed down. I mean, Wisconsin was pretty closed down for a while and people still aren't wearing masks. Yeah, so coronavirus it, is still it, here. I really was, I'm going to the beach soon, but it is near the shark game, I really like. Mm-hmm. And it's kind of scary. Mm-hmm. But... That's right. Because I'm brave. <laughs> but not brave with the dark. Because I hate the dark. What did you guys get for Christmas this year? I got... Colton got a lot of Legos, as you know, and an electric scooter. Um, the electric scooter was for me. <clears throat> and then... I got the whole ring security system from my friend, which was super yeah. unexpected and awesome. So I could like see my front door, what's going on. I got like a little echo show. Hold on, maybe. I got an echo show. I'm gonna put it in my room. And then I got another in-home security camera. So that was really cool. And then I got my four toast toaster and a bread maker. I can make bread myself, but I heard the bread maker is faster. So I'll probably try that. All right, baby, your turn. Um. And if you haven't noticed yet, uh, it's like a box right here. Um, and that has some of my stuff that I got for Christmas. I got this for Christmas, this for Christmas, these for Christmas, this for Christmas, this for Christmas, and some stuff in here I got for Christmas. Pretty cool. You're spoiled, aren't you? Yeah, I just <laughs> love I just love stuff from Christmas. Yeah, he, we have, we went to five, well, we didn't attend all of them, but we did like five Christmas exchanges um, because nobody seems to get along, but we do, so. Um, okay, thank you. <laughs> so uh, we did that. Um, I made a ham, um, and that, that ham, I actually, you guys, <coughs> in case you weren't aware if you have a ham that you forgot to defrost like me i had it in my deep freezer <laughs> i took it out the morning of christmas and i put it in my crock pot on high for the first hour so it defrosted enough to at least fit in my crock pot and then once the hour passed i put it on low and then i let it sit all the way to like 6 p.m and it was so juicy you guys i've never had a juicier ham i might do it that way every year but obviously colton and i couldn't eat it all so half of it's frozen i have the ham bones still um i'm gonna make split peas soup i think today and um probably have some wine today 
I got a ton of wine for Christmas. Not I already really, drank my favorite one. Not really like so much there flood our house. That's right. This is actually a little cup I got from my neighbor friend, um, Alan and Justin. It says drink wine, feel fine, but this is actually just my emergency, so hopefully that works too. <laughs> Sorry, baby, I cut you off. Why did you cut me off? That stuff is so gross. I hate orange. Why did you cut me off, Mommy? On accident. My bad. That's her <laughs> Sorry. Okay. I'll you. Oh, another thing that Colton and I have been doing. So there's like this free plant exchange site on Facebook. And Colton's been really into like plants and you know how they live in different varieties so i went in there and they, these ladies just give away free plants and some gentlemen as well or, or you can exchange plants so <clears throat> what we did is there's giveaways of plants and so we signed up for some of the giveaways and Colton actually got some um which are really pretty colton you want to show some of your plants quick You have nine right now. That one? Cool. One. Um, this one right here. I have that right now. And one right here. You gotta bring it over, baby. Okay. I don't really want to bring it over. Oh. We well, don't have to. Um, and this one over here by the front door. And of course, it's a fake one. Well, they can't see anything. Oh, there's that one. That one's not fake. Yeah, That's good. a Thanksgiving cactus. Yeah, and it and it grows white flowers on it. That's right. And but that could probably take a year. Yeah. Um, and I have nine flowers. And if and if I wanted one more, that would make ten. <laughs> right, mommy. Mhm. Mm That's what you get in the face. I love you. Oh. So what's in store for 2021? Um, Work-wise, I'm hoping for a promotion. Um, I feel like I did really good this year at work. I mean, I always put my best effort <laughs> into work, but I was really hoping I get a promotion this year. I won't find out until mid-year, I think. Um, but I'm going to keep working towards that. If you guys don't know, I am an engineering and construction project coordinator for a Fortune 1000 company. Um, I love it. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. <coughs> I do like their data analytics. I do, I make sure that we're on time with tasks. You know, I set, help set baselines. Um, I make sure that our team's cues are pretty even out. Or if things are running past due, I make sure that we get those moving forward. There's a lot of different things that I do, including training, including some <laughs> accounts payable type stuff. Um, I really do like it, but it is a really busy job. So with Colton being at home, it does make it a little bit more difficult. Um, but I think we've done pretty well. I was more productive at home, actually, because not everyone was stopping at my desk. Um, so that's been beneficial, but I definitely need a bigger desk for home. Because I feel just so crammed in my little desk. Um, Colton James. What? Do you guys ever have that where like kids just get louder when you're trying to do something? <laughs> I know you guys do and Colton loves to do it. Um, yeah, so promotion would be great. I'd love that. I don't foresee us going back to office until like June-ish. June if they do, I did ask for a hybrid flexible um, office space just because work from home does work for me. Um, but I do need the option to be able to go to the office. <laughs> At least he drinks his water, right? <laughs> yeah. Um, what else? I plan on doing some collabs with Shane Has Tattoos. I don't know if he changed his uh, YouTube name, but I'll link his uh, YouTube in the description. He's actually a good friend of mine from Australia. Uh, we actually met gaming, gosh, several years ago. And we always just talk. And he's really so funny. Um, and his his videos are really hilarious. Remember my friend Shane from RuneScape? Yeah. Yeah, that's him. Oh, that's Yeah, so there's a couple, like, little collabs we want to do. It will be super fun, but you guys should... <coughs> Excuse me. Go check them out. 
Um, so I wanted to do that. I probably won't do much mukbang this year or like the eating show um, just because I just get, I'm so busy. Um, so I probably won't do that, but I'll probably do some more cooking videos. I know a lot of people want to see my salsa uh, recipes that I've been doing. Um, if you haven't followed my Instagram or my Facebook, you totally should. <laughs> or even my Snapchat. Um, but I am going to do more cooking stuff and probably more, uh, I don't know, vlogs like vlog days and stuff i'll probably do that i don't know if i can set a schedule yeah, yeah. colton james please yeah. <laughs> i don't know if i can set a schedule just because um i'm just so busy i never know <coughs> what's happening in life <laughs> but uh but uh, yeah um but I just wanted to come in and say hi, eat my breakfast with you guys. It's gone already. Um, I know, I eat that toast way too fast, but whatever. And just see how you guys are doing. Let me know how you are. I miss you all. I know there's a lot of kiddos that are missing mine and Colton's videos. So, hey, Tona. Or Tonya, Tonya. I've never said your name out loud, girl. I'm sorry. And your daughter. Hi, how are you guys? Mama Didi, I hope you're doing okay. She's been in and out of the hospital. I'm praying for you. I'm hoping for you. Uh, and Sarah Jane's journey, of course. Um, Angie had her baby a while ago. Six months now. <clears throat> I have two babies that are coming around in my family any day now. I'm glad it wasn't in 2020. Because uh, hopefully this year is better. But um, yeah. I'll check out, I'll check with you guys later. I guess I'm not gonna do a whatever I do in a day video because it's already 16 minutes long. So nobody needs to see my face that long, I promise you. <laughs> but I might, I'm probably gonna film my uh, split pea soup recipe today and that'll be a separate video. So if you wanna see that, make sure you click that subscribe button, put the notifications on and I'll check you later. Say bye Colton. Bye.